Hi everyone. All right, so we're here. Um, it's time to create your own blog. Just head on to blogger.com. As mentioned earlier, our platform that we're gonna use in creating and building your own blog is blogger.com. Okay, so just uh, type blogger.com on your here on your web browser. Um, I'm sure that you know what your web browser is. So just type blogger.com. Um, in the comment section, I will I will put the link as well later on or in the description box. I'm going to put it there. So just click on the link and head on here. Now, if you have not created, if you have not created your own blog yet through a blogger uh, platform, now um, just, direct, just click on this button as you can see, create your blog. Just click on that since you have not created one. So create your own blog. So now, um, as you can see, uh, um, I have here my emails. Okay, um, let's just pretend um, that we have not created yet any, any um, Google account yet. So this is for those who has not really, really, really tried creating their own account. They um, have not tried signing up to any of Google products like YouTube, uh, Gmail, blogger uh and other products so let's just try to um use another account and let's cre create um i'm just gonna create like uh a dummy account okay Th this is just for 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 tutorial purposes okay um let's see maybe jps Um, click next. Oh, it's gonna find Google account. Oh, create account. Sorry, let's create account for my to manage my business just uh, for myself. Okay, type your name. So, for example, my name is that one, and username. Let's just say this is just for so username. Um, it could be your nickname or wh whatever uh, that you can think of. And this one, since uh, this is um, this is Google's account, so we're creating our Google account, and it has an extension at gmail.com. Just leave it at. Not complicated. Just type your username, whatever that you will like. And there's also a suggestion here. You can choose it, but just make sure that you remember your username, okay? As well as your password. So now it's time to create your password. Um, I might forget this so later <laughs> because it's just so, so let's see. Okay, since this is just you know. Oh no, our username is taken. Let's change it. Let's try. It's still taken. Why? There are a lot of people named um, names. Shy? 2021. Let's see. Still not. Shy, one, two, three. Ooh! Ah, uh, this is the harder part. Easy. One, two, three. Oh no. Mm. Okay, try this one. Okay, it works. And our password is the same. Okay, now time to verify your phone number. I'm not sure if we can proceed. No, we can. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna ask is a code. If you're with me, then 
um, you can have your own code. You can enter your own code right now. Let's see that. Let me just check. Okay, I'm entering the code now. Click verify button. Okay, now uh, you will be asked to enter your recovery email address. Um, if you have your uh, alternate email address, you can enter it here, but but it's optional actually. But it it can help you later on, um, just in case you forget your email address or your password you know just for verification purpose as well you can enter your birthday uh, since this is just dummy so i'm just gonna be creating um you know there's not for today it's 33 okay um, All right, so just enter all the information required and click the next button. Okay, get more from your number. Um, skip, just skip that. That's not important. But if you can, if you want, would like, to just click agree. Okay. all right oh no all right we're here we have entered a blogger blogging pla blogger platform okay so as i've mentioned earlier uh you have to prepare your blog name okay so if you have already prepared your blog name uh, you can enter it here um you type it here uh for me let me see i'll just try to um enter uh, a title that's uh, related to food because um although this is dummy but yeah because because i have a brother i told him to that i'm gonna create a blog for him so he can also earn for um let's just all things food is not available i have already tried it but like we'll see we'll see i just wanted to be related to food and we'll see if it's available yes but how about here now it's time to after clicking the next button uh, you'll be asked to choose a URL as I mentioned earlier again um, we need to enter a URL now you can enter here a different um, information separate different from your blog title or blog name but um, I highly recommend that uh, for you to be to be to for your brand or for your blog to be easily um you know remember just choose the same for your blogging uh, for your url or blog address as well as for your blog title okay so i'm gonna uh try if this is available no it's not all things good it's not so i might uh go back previously oh no i can actually you can actually change this later but what's important is because the title can be available even if it has like a duplicate it is like duplicate online um another website named the same but it it can however the blog address can't because it this should be unique so i need to think of something that's related to food so all things food is not avail available so Home foodie, home foodie, what else? Is it? Home foodie. Things. I'm not prepared for this actually, <laughs> but I tell you to prepare yourself so that you won't be um, having a hard time thinking, because this was really my problem, and even until now, it's still my problem. Home foodie, home foodie page, not available. Home. Ah, foodly. How about that? Oh. Ah, 
this black and so available oh it's available now okay now you might think you might be wondering um there's that blogspot.com here at the end well this one here um this is the extension name of your url or your blog address uh, this is a free version free uh version of your blog um this can be changed li later uh you can you can change it to directly foodly uh, com. um that is if you you already have uh bought if you have your own domain name you have already bought your own domain name okay but um for for the meantime um you can you can have this address so you'll have fully page blogspot.com as your website address or url okay just go and click next button since you don't have uh, let's assume that we don't have a domain name yet because we don't have a budget we don't have money yet or um we have not bought yet because you know we prioritize building so let's just assume it's, it's that situation so confirm your display name now this display name is your like your name that will appear on the blog so for example if you want this to uh if you want to have your name displayed here you can like your your real name or if you can if you want to use alias then you can or um admin because you are the owner you can use admin just uh, like that just like other websites we the, they don't use the blog owner's name just use admin you know uh just click on finish button all right so here we are in the dashboard and it might uh be confusing to you if this is your first time but don't worry um i felt that that's what i felt when i first created my blog here in blogger and even in wordpress and in other you know in other blogging platform but don't you worry because just like when you first use facebook you'll get used to this afterwards but for now since we're beginner we all we are all beginners so i consider myself as, as a beginner since i'm creating this one for you um just follow the steps that i need okay so here, here is your title all things food here and this on the le left side portion is dashboard now we have um a portion for creating posts and this one stats this is for viewing the, the status of your blogs like for views and comment section this one here if uh, someone commented you can look at everything here and for earnings this one is if you have already if you have already um optimized your blog or your blog website uh, for monetization uh, let's just go go in there and so just quickly show you so here you can create your new adsense account but i suggest that don't touch this one yet unless you already have um optimized your website and at least you already have at least 15 uh, written published articles okay so now let's move forward let's go to pages this is where you create your pages but but um i'll i'll make a separate tutorial for this okay because i don't want to um overwhelm you with so much information just familiarize the dashboard first just familiarize the platform first just like how you familiarize facebook and other social media platforms social media pages okay all right so here's the layout this is where you design your your uh the layout of your website of your blog okay now um you have heard uh, i have already mentioned earlier the themes well uh there are free themes and um there are also customized themes like uh the paid themes or templates but there are also free themes that are really really good and you don't have to buy ones but i will still again create another tutorial for this okay now let's move to settings the settings is very important this is where you optimize your blog or your blog website okay now here you can as i mentioned earlier you can change the title just click on that um, you can change it i don't i won't change it for now oh 
since our our blog our blog URL is what was that again? Um, foodly page. We can do that now. Okay, we we'll just change it. So just to show quickly show you. Okay, now here's the description. The description is very important. This is part of you know SEO, but I will mention that I will again create another tutorial for that. But you can just describe your blog simply. Later, um, I will teach you how to optimize this one for um for search engine ranking okay but let's just create a dummy one description but, but you can optimize your own just describe your your own blog properly that the description really is really closer relevant to your to your blog title or to your topic okay this blog is about um food just simple like that and click save okay now um i don't want you to 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 the other things are important but for now it's not important just because we what our purpose today is just to create your own blog and publish your first post okay so for privacy visible to search engines yes because you want your blogs to be to be searchable by search engines to be available to your post you want your post to be to be available in search engines like when somebody search search for a certain keyword keywords you want your articles to show up on the on the search engine results pages right okay so here the black address the one that we created earlier the blogspot okay since this is free one so we're using the, the extension that blogspot.com so your again your blog address is your chosen cho chosen blog address then the extension which is the blogspot.com so whenever you want to share it to your friend then you simply have to to actually you can simply have to uh type this one and together with uh, the extension blogspot.com okay since this is we are still using the the free one but don't, don't you worry um your your website is still okay it can still be you know read by or visible in search engines your your friends your your family can still view your your blog if you have already created a lot of articles there so so this one is deep by default there's nothing really you can change in here and let's go down for the post we can change that later for the comments you can change that later and for the other things um, here in enable search description yes this is very very important um search description well you can um you can put the the description of your blog what is what is it about okay um you can put the one that i i, I entered earlier this blog is about food Oh, okay click save and for the other things you can customize this later especially if um you have we are already uh, we already have at least uh 15 to 30 articles with published articles on our blog and we have already our, our custom we have already bought custom domain name okay crawlers and indexing we can do that later for monetization again as well we can do that later for the other things okay now the important thing is um for the theme right we have already since we're already in the dashboard um the layout is also very important but with the theme actually it also it already has its, its own layout and we can follow that for now okay okay um let's go to theme and from here let's choose our own um design or template um what color do you want you can go from contempo select from any of these if you're if you want it to be like uh you want your blog to be fresh looking then you can go for this one something green or blue or if it's if you you want uh, if it's related to ours you can go for orange or whatever you like maybe you can go for uh for your favorite color 
okay and you can go down there are a lot here so um i'm just i'm just gonna choose one okay um here is notable you can choose uh, whatever you like let's just go down first there's simple there's dynamic picture window awesome um i'll go for something beautiful okay so maybe i'll go for this yes i like this so beautiful and so trendy although there are a lot a lot of you know um beautiful templates that i'm gonna show later so i'll just choose well see where's the makeup oh this one um no i love a lot of pictures so I'll go for black something black it's attractive for me okay just choose that one okay and click just click that one and here uh this is under soho and the title of this design or template or theme is emporio technica just click apply apply for now okay um we will customize it later but for now just click apply all right because we're gonna publish our first post after this okay new theme successfully applied so it's successfully applied so let's view it and we're gonna how are you gonna view here just click on just put down scroll down and click view blog Ta -da! and here it is this is your own blog congratulations you already created your own blog however you didn't have a post yet so that's the time that we're gonna pub publish your article and also um optimize afterwards for monetization so this is your title blog title this is your blog address you can copy this you can copy and paste this and share to your friends okay or to share to facebook groups if you want other people to read your your articles to share your to share your ideas you know and this is the description and there's nothing here because we have not created yet and these other things here um that you can optimize if you'll go for layout but since um we will not create the layout yet but publish your first post yet so that you will have you will already have your your blog running up and running now time to create posts so since we don't have a post yet so what we're gonna do is come up here new post go here on um on top but just below the blog title okay just click a new post all right all right now it's time to create your first article or first blog now it it can be confused confusing but just follow the instructions just do as what i i i told you to do okay so here's your title so since it's full let's just say um you you're gonna create uh, a recipe okay so i'm not really good in cooking <laughs> but uh, um let's just say baking okay a uh, basic baking uh, bake uh baking basics okay just basic baking information basics. baking basics oh um um i know baking but i'm not not gonna i'm not really right now my brain is not working freaking i'm not really good but then again, I'll just uh, put dummy here. So this is this is the intro. It is the intro. This is about baking, okay? And here you're gonna create your um your sub uh subtitles or subheadings. This is very important as well. I'll just quickly show you how you can create write your first post, okay? So let's just say baking definition. This is your subheading, um, major heading, heading one. And baking definition, baking, baking tools here. And uh, what else? You know, I suggest that before you write, um, you first create your own draft, okay? if uh, before writing or publishing but if you are 
really knowledgeable, you can go ahead and write it immediately. Then you can also create outline. What I'm doing right now is I'm actually I'm creating an outline. So here is the intro. This is about baking and but you don't you don't put intro okay on your article. You don't put this is just for outline purposes. And here is for baking definition. So this since this is a major heading, so I'm gonna um optimize it to major heading. That's it. Okay, so baking is this making is making is blah 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 and making tools um heading okay okay so what are the baking tools spatula um what else spatula uh my brain is not working a spatula what else um dish drainer is it <laughs> Uh, of course, oven. You need that. Uh, what else? Um. Oh, just you can actually search it in Google. Okay, if you're not good, at, it depends. But right now, I'll just simply show you that if this is how you you write your article. But I will still give. I'll provide another tutorial on how you can write your own article or your your first blog if you have not written even once okay so since you have already your title and let's just say you already you're done with your article you have already created your article now it's time to publish and what you're gonna do is really just click this button here however you might want to use label so for example um it's all about food but you have you will write about a lot uh, of topics like you will write about baking, you'll write about um, sous vide, you'll write about fufu, you'll write about food smoking, um, grilling, uh, what else? You'll write about dessert. So you can put it here baking as label or baking, a uh, baking uh, tools like that. And down here, um, the permalink is actually very important as well. This is your URL. You can have it. You, you just go for automatic permalink, but you can also choose for custom permalink where you have to um, customize your own URL or your your own article link. Okay. So since it's baking basics, the title is baking basics. So let's just go for that. So this will be your um url okay so that's okay now location you can change that whatever location you are in search description this is actually very important for seo or for google for google um ranking later for seo i, I will explain this later but for now I, I don't want to again um complicate everything so you can simply actually you can just copy your intro maybe just a few lines um one to two sentences and put it here because that's what will appear um on search engines on google search uh on serps search engine results pages is that the description below the title that will that will um um that will show up so here's the option if you want to uh, allow comments or not you can you can select it here okay all right since um we have already optimized the important things so now it's time to publish okay just click confirm all right so if you go to to post section here on your dashboard you can see that you already have published your first post here the baking basics and to view your blog your first article you just click this one here and it's gonna bring up okay it's gonna bring up your article all right i'm um, not sure if you you are able to show uh see it but yeah it's gonna bring up your website and and that's it you already have your own blog you have already published your own blog so again congratulations so the next thing that we're gonna do is 
buy your own custom domain name. All right, so if you're ready to build your own blog, and if you are, you really want to focus on this and get serious with with um, blogging, and if you really want to to potentially earn through blogging, okay, so this is a time. Um, I suggest that you at least at least uh, invest for custom domain name because because again um, blogger is really really uh, a nice platform especially for beginners like you like us although I've been in the blogging industry but right now I consider myself as beginner okay so we could all so we could all go through this uh, we go, we could go all through the process all right so that's it for now and um, see you inside the Facebook group blogging for beginners. All right, so bye for now.